In 2005, two individuals embarked on a journey that would forever change the music industry. This is the story of Spotify. Founded by Daniel Ack and Martin Lorentzen in Stockholm, Sweden, these two individuals, despite their differences in skill sets and personalities, became friends and began discussing various ideas. The concept of Spotify arose from their frustration with the process of finding media on X home theater computer, which was quite cumbersome. Surprisingly, Spotify was X fourth company, and the name itself was a result of a mishearing when Lorenzen shouted to Ack from another room. Since there were no search results for Spotify at the time, they decided to register the domain name. On October 7, 2008, the Spotify application was officially launched. Even Facebook founder Mark Zuckerberg was an early fan, as evidenced by one of his status updates in the summer of 2009 that read Spotify is so good. By 2011, Spotify had already amassed 1 million paid subscribers, and later that summer, they made their debut in the United States. Following a casual meeting over a beer in Zuckerberg's garden, Spotify integrated with Facebook, allowing users to share their listening activities with friends. This partnership propelled Spotify's growth and solidified its position as a frontrunner in the industry. Continuing to push boundaries, Spotify later formed partnerships with Uber, enabling users to enjoy their favorite tunes during cab rides. They also introduced a 50% discount for college students, further cementing their dominance over competitors. Today, Spotify boasts over 75 million users, with 20 million utilizing its paid service. The story of Spotify is a testament to the power of innovation and perseverance. It serves as a reminder that great success can arise from humble beginnings. Join me as we dive deeper into the journey of Spotify and explore the impact it has had on the music industry. But before we proceed, remember to subscribe to our channel, like this video, and hit the notification bell to stay updated with the latest content. By doing so, you'll gain access to valuable insights and tips to help you on your path to success. Now, let's delve into the fascinating world of Spotify and discover the secrets behind its rise to prominence. But first, have you ever wondered how a simple idea can revolutionize an entire industry? How two individuals with a shared passion can disrupt the status quo? Well, that's exactly what happened with Spotify. Imagine being able to listen to any song you desire, anytime, anywhere. In a world where music is a universal language, Spotify emerged as the ultimate platform for music enthusiasts. From its humble beginnings in Stockholm, Sweden, Spotify quickly captured the hearts of millions around the globe. With its intuitive interface and vast library, it became the go-to destination for music lovers. But what truly set Spotify apart was its commitment to providing a personalized experience. Through its innovative algorithms, it curated playlists based on users' listening habits, introducing them to new artists and keeping them engaged. As Spotify continued to grow, it forged strategic partnerships that propelled it even further. Collaborations with major artists and record labels allowed exclusive releases and behind-the-scenes content, enhancing the overall user experience. In 2023, Spotify stands as the undisputed leader in the music streaming industry. Its influence extends beyond mere entertainment, as it has nurtured emerging artists, reshaped how we discover music, and even impacted the way artists are compensated. But what can we learn from Spotify's success? How can we apply its principles to our own lives? The answer lies in embracing innovation, pursuing our passions, and constantly adapting to change. So, my friend, I invite you to reflect on this journey and ask yourself, what actions will you take inspired by Spotify's story? What goals will you set for yourself, and how will you overcome the challenges along the way? Remember, success is not attained by mere observation. True growth comes from implementation. So, let's embark on this adventure together, channeling the spirit of Spotify and crafting our own paths to success. As we wrap up, I want to express my gratitude for your time and attention. If you found this video valuable, consider giving a tip proportional to the value received. You can find the link in the description below. 
Thank you for joining me on this enlightening exploration of Spotify. Until next time, my friend, stay curious, stay determined, and keep chasing your dreams. End. Hey there, it's Max Sterling. Today, I've got a story that will give you a glimpse into the mindset of the most successful people out there. We're going to talk about the professional British cycling team, also known as Team Sky. Believe it or not, they were once considered one of the worst teams in the world. In fact, they had only won a single gold medal in the entire 76-year history of competing in the Olympics. Their reputation was so bad that popular bike manufacturing companies didn't even want to associate their brand with Team Sky. That's how down and out they were. But then, in 2002, they brought in a guy named Sir Dave Brailsford to manage the team. Now, Brailsford had an MBA and he had an interesting concept in mind called the theory of marginal gains. The idea was simple. If you improve every aspect of the business, every little cog and wheel, by just a small percentage, the overall improvement would be tremendous. And that's exactly what Team Sky did. They started making tiny improvements in every area. They found lighter tires, more comfortable bike seats, and even figured out how to reduce dust in hard-to-reach parts of their bikes. They hired a surgeon to teach them proper hand-washing techniques and change their mattresses and pillows for better sleep. They optimized their nutrition, split-tested massage oils, and made countless small changes that no other team was paying attention to. These changes, individually, were hardly noticeable. Just a few percentage points here and there. But when you add them all up, it made a world of difference. In the 2008 Beijing Olympics, Team Sky won 7 out of 10 gold medals available for track cycling. And they didn't stop there. In the following London Olympics, they won seven more gold medals. And to top it all off, they won four out of the last five Tour de France races, something that no British team had ever achieved before. So what does this have to do with the mindset of successful people? Well, it all comes down to the concept of continuous learning. The most successful people out there are always seeking new information, always striving to improve themselves just a little bit every day. They understand that every small gain adds up to something huge over time. And that's why I believe in the power of knowledge and growth. That's why almost all of my videos on this channel are packed with information that can help you improve your life, even if it's just a tiny bit. Because those small improvements, when done consistently, can make you stand out from the crowd. So, my friend, take that improvement pill every single day. Keep learning, keep growing and keep making those small changes that will lead to big results. Don't settle for mediocrity when you can become exceptional. If you found this video valuable and want to continue on this journey of self-improvement, make sure to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. By doing so, you're taking that first step towards achieving the benefits we've talked about in this video. Now, before we wrap things up, I want to leave you with a question. What are the actions you're going to implement in your life after watching this video? Take some time to reflect on that and share it in the comments below. And remember, if you truly found value in this video and want to support the channel, you can give a tip proportional to the value you receive. The link to do so can be found in the video description. Until next time, keep pushing yourself to new heights and never stop learning. Stay ambitious, my friend.